He's channeling his inner uh, ghouls and goblins. Ghosts and goblins. <laughs> yep. Let's see here. Is there any other objectives? Okay. Made 16 dishes. Mm. Oh, jeez. I can't believe this. I made it to Water 7, and now I just look, and there's more side quests. Woo. The only reason why I came back here was just to get that last friggin' bounty. Well, I mean, if you really want to do that, we can. We're, we're never going to leave Water 7, are we? We're going to just be trapped there. Oh, wait a minute. There, Wait a minute, there's something there. <laughs> Please tell me I can reach it. There's a, um, there's a cube fragment there. There we go. Yeah, you have to look, yeah, in this story, in this game, you have to look around everywhere for all these cube fragments. Because they're the only way to, um, upgrade, um, char to upgrade, um, character abilities. Mm -hmm. By the way, um, the way that I'm using this is I'm using a wireless connection between this and the PS4. So there is going to be so there is going to be like um, lag and things on the game itself. A lot of input delay. Oh yeah, kid said like um, zero X zero had better hair and busters are cooler than pistols. Yeah, I agree with that. I don't know. I've always preferred, like, pistols to arm cannons and busters and things like that. Personally, I prefer dragoons. Oh, we know what you prefer. <laughs> Which type of dragons? But it's just an old timey term for carbines. Oh. Now, we want to talk about guns in general. I really like revolvers. I really do like me some short rifles, though. It's a nice aesthetic. Personally, I prefer the sky, says Kit. Personally, I prefer the air. Yeah, when um, yeah, when Falco uses his um, final smash. His yeah. landmaster. Yeah. Oh, that. <laughs> Falco is best character. Wombo combo. I actually really like the Star Fox games. I, I want them to come back with like a proper non-remake of Star Fox 64, which is a remake of the very first Star Fox game. Yeah. Okay, good. It does not it does not look like there are any side quests, any extra side quests here in It does not look like there's any extra side quests in um, in Alabasta, but I still have to go to the freaking. Um, I still have to go to the. Um, I'm trying to remember where it was, the um, perfume shop here. Mm -hmm. it, I'm all about ROF with guns and games. I play Tau in 40k because they have tons of rotary weapons with giant F U shaped size guns. Uh, the Tau weapons are cool. I just this is probably going to ruin my friendship with uh, Kit, but I do not like the Tau in 40k. Uh, what I prefer talking? kind of the design of uh, the Imperium's weapons where it's kind of boxy and uh, Retro futuristic. Really, I just like retro All right. futurism. All right. Oh, yeah. Spice bean. I think with sort of the modern era and the onset of minimalism, we've had a pretty big problem of trying to make everything as sleek 
and as simply designed as possible, which does certainly have its benefits, but I really do not like the modern futuristic aesthetic of everything being ultra aerodynamic and then the insides of every vehicle being just so sterile, just blank white hallways, nothing to really bring any life into it, and then everything with just these control panels with holograms, no real buttons or switches anymore. Whereas the old designs, you had the big clunky keys, you have all these designs that are just laden with aesthetic. It's very nice. Yes. Uh, I'm all about ROF with guns in games. I play the Tau in 40k because they have tons of rotary cannons and giant FU size guns. Yes, we can no longer buy we can no longer be friends. I'm turning in my member card to your fan club. No, please don't go. It's like you both can have I was gonna say, um, when you're feeling better, Kit, then um, maybe sometime in one of these things, you both, you each can have like a proper debate about which one is better. Like both oh, of you no actually question. talking to each other. Oh, there's no question. Uh, the Imperial Guard is objectively best uh, for the Emperor. <laughs> Forty K does a little of everything design wise. Well, almost everything. No giraffe man with a square nose. Yeah, that's that's the one thing that Forty uh, K is missing is giraffe man with square noses. But yes, we put that in there and a all, franchise is safe. All games, all games need more Kaku. Yeah, need more what? Kaku's, Kaku is the uh, name of the, Kaku is the name of the man who can turn into a giraffe with the with yeah. the giant square nose. I see. Isn't yeah. The the man who popularized and created the most powerful technique known to uh, One Piece pasta machine. <laughs> He's saying like ah, I extended my I extended my arms and let you know, it's, it's like when you um put dough do through a um machine and it comes out as noodles like a pasta machine. Stands up. Pasta machine. <laughs> Don't think you did that on purpose. <laughs> Sometimes the dub truly is better than the sub. Yeah. Yeah, well, the dub that's... Yeah, there's one of the best lines that Nami ever says in... Um, one in um, One Piece. Is when she meets up with Khalifa... When she runs into Khalifa in Annie's lobby, and any and Khalifa is just being like, "Yeah, I am saying like my power is like truly great," and then Nami just straight up says in her head, "What a bitch! <laughs> wow, what a bitch!" <laughs> She's not wrong. Yeah, she is not wrong. So I, so I finally got the finally able to complete this. Happily, there are no side quests in Alabasta. So, happily, there's not that to worry about. But there is another... All these are done, so I don't have to do frickin' bounties. Yeah, I'm sorry. I think I have... I need a new cord for my controller. Because it keeps... Because it keeps cutting out. Okay, yeah, so there is... I need to go here. Because I do see another... Yeah, oh. No, go ahead. Sounds so dejected. But yeah, kid, I, I do love how 40k does everything design-wise, so... It, equal measure has widespread appeal while also keeping its own feel and world pretty consistent. It's, it's the ultimate uh, IGN franchise. It has a little something for everyone.
Okay, so looks like this side quest is just um, be is just um, dealing with a um, mice fight. So let's just go ahead and deal with that real quick. Is there um, trying to think here? I remember you all talk. I remember us trying to play um, like the like the um, Skaven Warhammer 40k game. Unfortunately, that didn't oh work yeah, out very Vermintide. Well. Vermintide, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Vermintide is really fun, but like. It's unfortunately one of those games where they put everything into the graphics, so trying to play it on anything besides some of the newer and uh, laptops and PC is like pulling teeth. Yeah, I'm having a lot. I had a lot of issues trying to play it. I even tried playing it um, after we were done streaming and everything, and it just does not work out. Yeah, I had to get a whole new PC to do it. Uh, but it's a really fun game so if you ever do uh, upgrade and we can play it I would love to play it with you man it's one of my favorite games uh, Kit says Dawn of War is my favorite Warhammer game series they go on sale on Steam a lot yeah uh, I got the first Dawn of War games all of them including uh Winter Assault, uh, Dark Crusade, and Soulstorm. I really love Dark Crusade. I love playing as the Guardsman in that game. Uh, I tried to get um, Unification mod working on Soulstorm, but I just couldn't because I'm dumb. Uh, I'll try it again at one point, but yeah, I really like the Dawn of War games. I love it, but so bad. But I'm so bad at RTS games. So, if you ever want a little kit abuse for stream, let me know. <laughs> that would be fun, and it uh, would be a cool stream just to watch uh, kids struggle with an RTS. Yeah. Get to bully the little fox boy. Yeah, they're saying like there's like mice in the sewers or something. Ah, oh, there's always mice in the sewers. We're we're really gonna just waste our time going into the sewer to hunt mice, okay? Yeah, I'm trying to. Wait, riveting, riveting stuff. This this truly is a JRPG. Yes, but I write epic poems and swear words, so I need to work on that or make it an 18-plus stream. <laughs> I, I think you're good either way, uh, Kit. We, 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 say some, we, we say some naughty things on these streams. We, we do not care. Okay, let's... Okay. Put that over there. Over so the course unusual, of this, I have completed unusual one, two, wicked mice. I need to find those. Seven, eight. eight models done. Are you? So I had to step out for a minute. Are you still chasing a bounty? That's no. I the next we got. Question. I got the bounty. I already beat the bounty. It's just that um, there's now a side quest to do. We have to find um, wicked brutal mice. Apparently, some apparently one of the members of the Frankie family decided, yeah, I'm gonna bring those in. They're pets. But it's but it's freaking out. But it's freaking out the guys. So I need to find where they are. Ah, huh. it's a good thing I searched here. Because I found Zoro's cube, I found a Zoro cube fragment. Oh, by the way, there's a durian um, gator, but in the background. 
I have a carnivorous death parrot. I can relate to these to those morons. <laughs> I really love the design of these guardsmen models. They're really cool. I'm so glad I bankrupted myself to get this kit. I'm getting the 10th edition starter box. You only need one kidney to live, right? Yeah, yeah, that's that's exactly what getting into Warhammer is like. Punch the gator. So, would you consider Frankie's Barrage an Ora 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 or a Muda Muda Muda? It definitely Ora 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 because he actually says Ora 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 in the manga version. Oh wow! Uh, because okay. he, because there's a big old manly fight between um, Frankie and a member of the Don Quixote family named Senor Pink. And by the way, Senor Pink's outfit is that he wears a baby bonnet and like a diaper. <laughs> uh... But he is the manliest man that ever manned. So yeah, manly, in fact, he has a bunch I of groupies. That. He has, he has yeah, like, groupies. There is a story I'm behind his outfit. It. There is a story behind his outfit. By the way, there is, There's... like... There is a, um... Yeah, there is a story behind his outfit. But one thing I will say about it... One thing I will say about um, the fight... Because there is a big old fight between Frankie and Senior Pink. Where... There's this big build-up with all the characters around him that are just going, um... That straight up goes like, um... Like, this is the greatest manly man fight that ever happened. And then the two techniques that are shown immediately after that is... Diaper Bomb and Nipple Light Special. <laughs> uh, okay. Interesting. Is like, no, nah, saying like, because all because all of um, Senior Pink's groupie groupies go like, go like he's so hard boiled. That, that's not at all what I would call it, but okay. <laughs> yeah, but there is a story, but yeah, but there is a actual story behind him wearing that outfit. Um, it's the outfit that his. Um, it was the um, outfit that his um, that his baby. That his child was wearing before he died, oh. and and the um and the shock of that uh, and the shock of um, the baby dying um caused his caused his wife to basically become um, comatose, and the only time that and the only time that um, he saw any type of reaction out of her was when he dressed up at when he dressed up in like the baby bonnet. So that's basic. So that's basically what he has been doing this entire time. Seems a little morbid for One Piece, but I'll allow it. Well, it's after the time. It's after Ace's death, so they've. Um, so it does get more. It does get a little darker. Yeah, but well, Ace's death is still like, oh, it's not baby murder. It's still like, oh, this is an important moment for Luffy's character, the death of someone who he considers his brother. Spoilers, by the way, for literally everyone. Uh, if you liked Ace when you first saw him, um, don't get too attached to him. <laughs> yeah, even Kit is just not sure what to feel. He's so unsure that he posted a peanut reaction gif from Rick Griffin's house pets. This man is completely flabbergasted. <laughs> oh. 
始めるとするかおらジョークさんユーバースポイラーズ、そのノブ、エストオミノバー、トゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティンプセントゥーティン Cool, I got, a, I got an item. It's sewer mud. Ah, lovely. That's what the kids are calling it these days. That's not mud. Interesting. That is not mud. Yeah, that's Totes m a g o a t s mud. Mud's Totes real, yo. Like, I, I, know the, I know the joke is Luffy stupid, but Luffy's smart enough to know that that's not mud. Oh, there is, do there is something I do want to show you, though. Look at what Sanji does in order to get up this、um, cliff. He kicks off the wall, but then he double jumps anyway. Yeah. Sanji has an ability known as、um, Skywalk. It's an ability that he learned. That's an ability that he learned during the two year time skip. It's basically the same thing as the moonwalk that,、um, cypher, that cypher pole agents use, but he calls it Skywalk. Because it's not as good. Yeah, I did, a, a I did a good choice、tools. upgrading Frankie's attack string. That sucks that、um, Zoro got paralyzed. Quick, someone play the song. At least this way,、um, Zoro won't take any damage. Everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine over here. Yeah. Why? What happened? Oh, nothing. Not it, just seemed like, it just seemed like everything was just like really silent for a while. No, sorry about that. I have to switch to loop.、Um, yes. I'm working on my models, and there's one where like only one foot is on the base. And that's getting very hard to keep it glued down. So, um, I'm not okay. I'm actually very depressed now. Actually, I'm thinking, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and buy some. Buy some. Stuff to attach to, to fuse into other fuse into other items. So then that way I can actually. So then that way I can make. So I ha, that way I have more control over what characters are.、Um, abilities are upgraded. Again, that'll be something that I'll do off, off screen. But the problem is, though, is that this is. This stuff is taking a while and it's becoming really irritating. No. I'm 
better off just going to Iceberg at this point and doing that. Just tell Iceberg, look, I couldn't do this shit. Let Tyrannosaurus. But yeah, they're dinosaurs in one piece. Yeah, they're all on an island called Little Garden. And until recently, it was also the home of two giants that were endless co that were in endless combat with each other. Mm -hmm. But I say only until recently because a couple of like. What is it like three chapters ago? The um, those giants actually stopped fighting and actually made it back home. Nice. Because Happy um, ending. like three thousand three hundred and sixty-six duels and like three hundred and three thousand three hundred and sixty-five draws and one win. It'd be funny if it lists the best statistic in that chapter, and it's just like a single page. It lists as that statistic, and it says one win, and it's like you see in the horizon one of them leaving, and in the forefront of the page, it's one of their helmets just on the ground, or like one of their weapons, whichever it is that they have. Yeah, yeah, because the original duel was originally supposed to be to the death. But their weapons were so worn out during the fight that um, the guy turned out to have survived. Okay, old sewage treatment plant. Where is that? But let's just go ahead and do this real quick. And what's the arm that touches that? Thirty-two. And thirty-one. By the way, are you hearing any music in the background for this particular time? Okay. I don't have I don't have the audio on for your stream because uh, it, it gets like a double. Like I can hear both uh, talking and on from my. From Discord and the streams. So. Very, I'm very quietly, sure. says I'm Kit. Sure. And I'm not sure what the audio is like. So I'm, I'm purposely keeping it off so I don't get a uh, double. I understand. Well, at least we have a nice chain of scenery. Now we get to see this location, see these locations at night. Yeah, it's interesting to see a little bit more of the world. The lighting of this game is quite good. A lot of these environments just look beautiful. I know you can almost forget that it's a One Piece game. Oof. I think I'm gonna head off. Um. So, yeah, so I can get dinner and stuff. Yeah, you go right ahead. Because it's almost six. Well, not yeah. almost six, but 30 minutes till six. At least where I am. Yeah. So you have yeah, a good night, alright? Mm -hmm. Alright, thanks for doxing your time zone to the rest of us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now we gotta find him quick. <laughs> alright, see you guys later. Right. See you, man. Have a good night. Now it's time for a fight. And by the way, happily throughout this entire stream, we've only dropped 59 frames. Wow. That's a record, I feel.
よしやるか<笑>ディアブルジャンブプルミエールアシーだ I really love Roshan's avatar. Yeah, Roshan's got a cool character. It's nice. Simple, but it has its own little bit of personality. Just obliterated that bean pole in the I'm having to go to an artist because something went wrong making my gifts. Oh, that sucks, man. What went wrong? Yeah. <laughs> 